to make a positive contribution to help drive South Africa in the direction that we want to go, that we want it to go in. And it's about how we play a part in that journey to make it happen. The question that people asked me when I came back is, why did you come back? And I said, I want to come back as a South African and I want to make a difference in South Africa. How I'm going to make a difference, I don't know. What I'm going to do to make a difference, I don't know. But I will figure it out along the way. In the time that I have been back, we've been very, very fortunate in the sense that we secured investment from Ford Motor Company to upgrade our facilities. We invested in 2019, we made the announcement of a billion dollars of investment into South Africa, 16 billion rand, to build the next generation range, which we're just in the process of launching. The really exciting thing about that is that we built 13 new factories in a special economic zone that we created with the government, where the government put in 4.2 billion rand into the facilities. The most important thing that I'm really, really proud of that the company did during this time period is that we created 1,200 new permanent jobs at Ford Motor Company and we created 10,000 new jobs in our supplier chain. That for me is making a difference in South Africa and about creating jobs and growing the economy in South Africa. And as I said, I am a true believer in this country's potential. Have we got challenges? Yes. I admire everybody who is studying right now under the impact of load shedding because, man, it can't be easy. I know a lot of houses have solar, they have backup power systems and things like that. But I just think about everybody who is studying at the moment and especially going into grade 12 and doing grade 12 this year, having to study under those conditions. I think it's a level of resilience and fortitude that you have that a lot of people don't have. And I really admire that in you, and I encourage you to really work hard and apply yourself because that level of, ten of tenacity, endurance, is going to set you apart. And you've got to harness that and see how you can use that going forward as you build your careers and you think about what it is that you want to do and how you're going to do it. In addition to that, we've also spent a lot of time looking at how, as a company, we can make a difference in people's lives. And to us, education.